and show you two possibilities for a four snowflake sculpture inside a six by six card. So the first way is just to continue with our slotted spokes um, and, and make a diamond shape. Okay, so in that case I would just fold in the notches or the tabs, I guess I should say, on my notched spoke, making sure that my little rectangle is towards the top. I would just slide it through another snowflake and unfold the tabs. And then to complete the diamond, I would do the same over here. So I'm just going to slide that in there, and then the last step would be to connect these two together over here. Now I've made a little diamond for snowflake sculpture, okay? And again, that's going to fold flat. It is hidden by the card itself, just barely. So I think in the instructions it will give you a measurement to put this base on at the right spot if you're going to do a four diamond sculpture because it is very tight in a six by six card. I want to show you that when it's flat. It really takes up the entire card. I'm going to take these two off. Again, I'm just going to fold in those tabs and slide them right out. And I'm actually going to keep these connected together because that's what I want. And now I'm going to show you how you link them together top to bottom. So the important reason that those little rectangular holes are at the top of your sculpture is because on the other side there's actually a slit. Do you see that right there where it's been slotted? That creates a little tab here that can be slid. I'm just going to separate it, go there and let it go right through that rectangular hole. And that's how you link them top to bottom. And then I'm going to do the same thing over here. I'm just kind of bending it so that that tab is exposed. I'm going to slide it right over my other snowflake until that tab goes through that rectangular hole. And then I like to kind of just adjust them that hole again. And there I've made another version of a four snowflake sculpture. This time it has two stories. And this time it won't be hidden by the card. I would have had to move my base forward. So you do need to pay attention to which way you're going to build your sculpture. Um, notice that I definitely have room for it. I just put my base a little too far back for that type of sculpture. 